Well, this is my second day on the way to Texas and Arizona and New Mexico. And I'm in Texas now. I'm in my van and I'm heading to Palo Duro State Park, which is way out there somewhere. But I wanted to, there was a shorter way to get there, but I wanted to come this way because this crosses the canyon and the river that goes through it. And uh, Palo Duro is the second largest canyon in the United States. And I'm going to stay there for a day or two or three. But I wanted to stop here and get a shot of this. It's cool. It's all that racket. We've been tonight. Can't get away from the racket. Well, there was my bed last night. Nice and comfy. Ooh, looks like my wife is some snacks here. Oh yeah, these look good. And something to wash it down. But this is the uh, part of the Palo Duro Canyon. I found a little overlook. I drove way out there. I drove down in the canyon, come from the north. And I found this little picnic area here. You get a great view of the, the whole canyon. I think when I get up in the state park, it's just going to be a lot more spectacular. I really do. Well, there's no wind right here. Well, there's a the road I came in on. Well, let's just uh, check and see what's on the what's cooking on the grill tonight at the big dog camp here. Sun's going down. Oh my goodness. Let's see, we got the uh, Rainier Mountain Series grill. Ma Magic Chef grill going here. We've got homemade chili. We've got Cheddar Jack cheese. We've got corn chips and Coca-Cola. And we're going to have a fine meal here in a minute. Let's see if it's hot enough. Nope, not hot enough yet. Bug bit me. Well, my mountain bike done good after I got the flat fixed. It's gonna cook the fire by side of that hard way. Use propane. This first time I've used this stove, and I really need a smaller pan, but that's all I had. Awesome.
creek back there. I never did find a thorn or anything on my tire. I didn't really go to the tube yet. Deep hill, but I made it. Well, I'm uh, rode my bicycle as far as I can ride it, probably about as far as anybody can ride it, to be honest with you, towards the lighthouse. And now I'm hiking to the lighthouse. If I can make it, if it gets really rough out here, I'll, I won't. Well, I hate to be a weenie, but I am not hiking up through there. And there's a good place to break a leg or an ankle up through there. That don't look much better. There might be an easier way over here and it might not. I'm gonna try it. But anyway, that's where I come from. Out through there. Fuck, it's cool there. My son would love riding this right here. I wish he was here with me. Can ride. He's a lot better rider than I am. He can ride this rough stuff no problem. There's a couple buzzards over there. Kind of keeping an eye on me. Rut row. If I get up this, I'd be surprised. It's time to push. Science says lighthouse trail that way. And I've heard that that's a real hard trail, Capitol Peak Trail. Bikes only, no horses. There's that cool rock up there. Morning.
think I'm gonna make it. There you go. Fortress Cliff. Fortress Cliff signs this. I see my truck down there. Took a break, and uh, there's the Rojo, Rojo Grande Trail, or Big, as they say here in the United States. Rojo, a young feller. Have a really good time. Well, I'm gonna have one too. I'm just gonna be walking and having it. Let me see. I think I can. I think gravity will take me down this down this hill here. Yes, it did. Gravity's still working. 